Hello guys and welcome to another vlog. Today we have something very special. We have two business partners who have bought two G-Wagons and they want to customize it with a bad anxiety body kit so they look identical. All the way from London and they're here today in the reception now we're gonna go have a chat with them and see exactly what they want doing with the car let's go meet them Mr Bonga how's it going sir is like it the first you time in? you've come to Bradford no no well, I'm always here yeah. uh, we work in a few hospitals around yeah? here so yeah we always Hi, here. Mr Rudha how are you good to see you and you we've been having uh, long conversations on the phone at least we met oh, and uh, we met a few months ago actually when uh, yeah, okay. Rudha had a, a G-Wagon an older one and he were gonna customize it but he decided to sell that and buy a brand new one. Brand new one but not yeah. only that, you two are both business partners. Yes. So tell us the story a little bit now, so because obviously you got two G wagons. So what was the plan? I ended up buying one G wagon. He had a Vela, and then he said, "I want G wagon." So we went, and then you know, upgraded. That's a big upgraded. jump, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, we just upgraded. Okay. But well, then, you're a big guy to sit in a Range Rover Vela. Yeah, I needed the space in the in the G wagon, and then he's always on your website. He yeah, loves he is. your vlogs. He is, he is a big fan. Yes. Thank you, Rudolf. Yes, I really appreciate no, that. You you your work, your yeah. work is. Thank you very awesome. much. But you did promise me with the first time when I saw you that you said I want you to customize my car. But yes. Not this one. You said yeah, I'm gonna buy a new one, yeah. and you followed up, and you've ended up buying two G wagons. Two. You're both business partners, I guess. Yes, we are. Yeah. So what do you guys specialize in? Any. Uh, just ambulance services. Ambulance just, services. Yeah, just ambulance services. That, that's what we do. So, but then now we really want our cars to look like your cars. Yeah. We want them to look different. We don't want them to look like anything else on the road. Completely, completely, completely different. I don't want any chrome on my car. Okay. But we're going to leave you to, to do the design. So some people design, probably yeah. watching are thinking, well, yeah. the Mercedes G-Wagons, G63 models as well. Why would you want to customize them? Everyone has got the same. Okay. We don't so why do you want to be different? Because we want, we want to stand out. I want to stand out, exactly. Stand out. But you work yeah. hard, right? Yeah. So you've got to appreciate, obviously, definitely. you know, yeah. the finer things in life. Mm. Definitely. But the we thing is, you both having the same body kits, that's the question. Are you having different no. wheels, different colors? I don't think different color cars, right? So that's the only difference on it. Everything the same when, when it comes to our cars. I think the only difference is going to be just the colors on the cars. Yeah, that's But it. everything else is going to be the same. to look same. When they're parked next to each other, people need to know that those boys are here. This guy is my mentor. <laughs> right, okay. He's, he's, he's it seems that like you have a great relationship, which is very special. We're pretty much brothers. It's very yeah. special yeah. because obviously in business, business yeah. Yeah. you know, especially yeah. having business partners, it yeah. can be difficult. But maybe at the end of the show, when you collect your car, hopefully you're happy with the cars, you can give them a little motivational speech, a motivate inspiration for their viewers, especially the youngsters that are watching. We're not planning on changing the rims, but we've just seen these. Okay, we've nice. Just seen these. We've just seen these on both of them, please. The 23 inch Casanova. Yes. We do them in 22 inch and 23 inch. If I had a choice of putting the wheels on my car, it would be the 24 inch XL and the 23 inch Casanova. We're going for them. Also. Are you going to change the wheels? Yeah. That means you'd have to change the wheels as well, doesn't it? Wow. Okay, I can make that decision for him. Can you both make that decision? Yeah. Both this is a great partnership. I love this. <laughs> both cars are giving these rooms. Shall I show them the interior? How about Star Galaxy roof lining? Definitely. Yeah. Yeah? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. What can I throw out? I'm not gonna win it. Money is no object, yeah. Just <laughs> you know, the cars look different. Yeah. Listen to all my cars have got starlights inside, so both of them need to have starlights as well. So I can't be driving one car that's different from Because oh, this customization is getting yeah. a lot bigger. Yeah. The program's getting a lot bigger, but I don't mind. So we're going for the 23 inch Casanova alloy wheels. Yeah. We're going for the Star Galaxy roof lining. We're going for the Baragzai body kit. Yes. yes. I want your kit. Thank you, sir. I you appreciate that. that. Mm. I think that means a lot to me. your kits are there. There's other people. Right at the top, yeah. But you know, no, thank this, you very much. This, this, I think what it is, I think a lot of people do watch the vlogs and they see the passion that I have for my yes. work. That's I've done it since I was 14 years old. And I don't have to look about 16, but you know, I've done it for many, many years. And uh, I started in my back garden. I will tell my story one day. I keep saying it on a vlog one day, I will yeah. tell my whole story, I promise you. Yeah. But I still have that passion. Yes. You know, I've yeah. never worked for the money. You've got to be passionate about your work. Yeah. And I always say this to people watching. It's like when you want to find a career in something, try to find something that you enjoy doing. Right. When you wake up yes. every morning and you enjoy yes. working, and then yes. when you will come automatically, and I see yes. you guys love working together and you enjoy yes. doing what yes. you're doing. Work have to be, you know, you work hard, you will get the rewards. It's exactly. Simple. You know, people mm. say, oh, we're working. Work and enjoy your job, and that's what we do. You know, we, we, we don't get tired, although, you know, 
sometimes we do 24 hour but but okay. we do but not you, get tired you have to you have to, yeah. so you have to dedicate yourself to people don't realize you know oh you're driving g wagon what's behind it yeah you know there's a lot so of people bikes, hard work, hard work. So okay. right so okay we've got the wheels That's the got the body kit how about the bonnet we're going to put the bonnet on there we paint what color we paint the body kit because you've got an option so you've got the g wagon one's a blue one One's a grey one? Yes. And uh, do we want the body kit in black or do we want it the same colour as the car? For me, that I'll leave to you. I want to be surprised when I I think I'd it. rather have yeah. same colour. Yeah. Same have you got the bonnet yeah. to show us which, what is going to... Okay, we've got okay, we've got a carbon exposed bonnet we can show you right now quickly. So okay, this is the carbon exposed. Sakim, bring over the carbon exposed bonnet, please. Let's see. Yeah, that's nice. Yes. The question is, do we gonna have them exposed carbon or do we gonna the carbon? Yeah. Right, so what do you think? Whoa, wow, wow. It's already looking different, Yeah. That look exposed carbon. Yes. Okay, let's put on the blue one now. It looks better with the oh, that looks nice. Yes. yes. So welcome uh, to the it's HQ. Yeah, I think this guy's gonna make us buy another car. Is this car same color as your jacket and your cap? Yes, <laughs> I love that. Did you design this? Yeah, yeah. This is great. Cool. Right, so this is our workshop. Part of our workshop, we have uh, other uh, outbuildings outside. We do our uh, leather oh, custom interior, vinyl wrap, etc. Is this your work? Yeah, it's wide arches. Oh, okay. But what we've uh, what we've done. We've uh, put the wide arches on and moulded it into the bodywork and you can see we've done all the lining as well. Wow. So yeah. it fits. Perfect, yeah. Factory finish. Uh, yeah, so these are our defenders. We've got one oh, that just come in. Wow. This. What do you think of this one? This is one that just come in for the conversion. We're putting our new Balanzai Falcon body kit on there. Wow. You watched the vlog, haven't you? Yes. When we went to the Lake District. Amazing, amazing. Now, have you guys been to the Lake District? That's a question. Never. Adrian, have you? Been to no. go. No, no, not, not, not on all the day. Not on all the day. Just, just, just on business. This, Drive. this thing looks ridiculous. What do you think? You like it? Who's, 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 this who's car is it? This car's for sale. Yes. Who's is it? Oh, it, it's yours. Yeah, this is for sale. This is the one that we just uh, recently done. This is the black edition. We've got our forged carbon engine coming in there as well. Wow. It's got our. We're just finishing it off. Wow. We've just got the lads uh, putting the back lights in. This actually looks better than your one outside. Do you think? Yeah. A lot of people have said that actually. Yeah. Because uh, we did do. Uh, the vlog and we asked uh, people which car did they prefer and a lot of them did prefer this one the all I'm not black edition to be rude, but this one yeah looks way better than your car yeah oh. so it, it, it's got something about it i still prefer my own that's my own choice we were going to get the taxi back to london well you taking this back yeah yes i think i'm pretty sure we're taking this back you like it yeah i'd like to have to take it today no. no, so we need to go back to London, so we think this, we'll this is going to be another prank, taking... isn't it? Remember when Naz came last time with all his mates and stuff and they pranked me? But this no, like we're serious, we're going to take an Uber back. We're yeah, taking this the back. Cab. I was going to ask you how you get him back. Yeah, yeah we're going to take an Uber back. I was going to ask him to take a, maybe hire a car. But I don't rent them. No, 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 we're, we're going to buy it. It's your work. Come on, just buy it. Just stop it. You can't. We, no, we're buying this. We, we're leaving with this. We're not leaving this here. You did say you're bringing a friend down with a kid in a candy store, but he's good. <laughs> he's good on camera. I'll give him that. Yeah. He's a good actor. He loves, he loves buying cars. Trust me, wherever he goes. Is he ready? Yeah. Does he really want to play? He will buy. You think I'm joking? Are you serious? I want to stop pulling my leg. I would never joke on camera. It's not good for my reputation as well to make people. If this is a prank, this is a very good prank. No, we take. Tell me the partner. You saying I'm only joking? Call no, order no, 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 taxi. No, we're taking it. We're taking it. Let's let, let's do paper. Yeah, let's. If the, if Adrian's All right, I'm, I'm just gonna go along with it. We're actually buying it off you. Yes. Because we're gonna need the right people. Okay, I'm just gonna go along with it. So, no, you are selling it. Yeah, I am selling it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So everything's ours. for sale at the right price, of course. Yeah. It's ours. You might as well buy them both then. You can buy one defender, you can buy another one. No, but one today. He wants me to drive back here so he can sit like a boss. This one, we have done the interior in this one. We have done the interior on our expedition park. Oh my gosh, your interior is ridiculous. So when you come back to pick up the G-Wagons, we'll come back with this one. And then you need to do the, what do you call the star lights in this one as well. And the dish lights. You know the lights that go all the way around. Like the ones in the ambient lights. Yeah. Does it? Do they do ambient lights or no? I can't, I, I can't take you guys. Uh, uh, okay, I'm not taking you guys seriously. 
No, we're taking this. Done. Deal yeah, is so done. when you come back, that, this will be the next project. We would want the, what you could the sun Starlights. lights and the ambient lights. And then... Uh, if you need this to is the case, because any, any, I'll have more customers like this. I don't mind. <laughs> and then uh, change the interior to... The leather dashboard. To the leather dashboard. Yeah, that look awesome, the leather dashboard. So, are we buying the car? Yes. Yeah, it's sold. Are you sure? Yes. Mm -hmm. Luke! They've just bought the car. Yeah, Are you going to finish it off? Yeah. Right, okay, I think I need some water. <laughs> right, okay, so this is the first time this has happened to me, actually. Can you believe that? They've come here to get both of their G-Wagons customised and they've ended up buying a Defender off me. You guys are probably thinking this is all set up but I'm telling you hand on my heart, it's not. They've genuinely come here to get their G-Wagons customised. They've seen the Defender and it looks like to me that they're going to be driving away with the Defender because they wanted to lift on. Well, if there's any more customers out there like Raza and Adrian Please come visit me more often, thank you very much. But anyway, I will take care of them. I mean, seriously, these guys are like kids in a candy store. They love cars, they see the Defender, and I just appreciate that they actually like my work, and they see the passion in my work, and uh, they ended up buying a car off me. Well, that Defender will be driving around in London, so stay tuned. But anyway, they're in there doing the transaction with Imran. Let me clack on and customise their G-Wagons. Okay, so we have the G-Wagon, Mr. Bonder, or is it Mr. Gonder? Well, anyway, we've got one of the G-Wagons in the workshop. Uh, the other one has gone to get the wheels fitted on there. Now, we decided to go for the 23-inch Casanova in gloss black. We were going to put the 22-inch, but we finally decided the 23-inch. Not going to show you just yet, wait till the end. Now, the million-dollar question, which they've totally left to me. Now, this is where I get all my white hairs from, when a customer leaves most of the decisions to me. Now. They've said to me, either leave the body kit black or paint it the same colour as the car. Unless we paint the bonnet black as well, but I think leaving it exposed carbon, that'll give it a nice feature. Paint the top roof spoiler, gloss black, bottom lip spoiler, gloss black. Coming round the car, remove all the badges, put some black badges on there. And we've got Oma at the back, fit in the rear diffuser or rear valance. Rizwan sent me a video of Mr. Gonda valeting the Defender. There you go. <clears throat> so as soon as I got back, the next morning, Adrian, AKA Mr. Gonda, he spent the whole day valeting the Defender. Boss man! Boss man! <laughs> anyway, they're enjoying the Defender, I'm happy about that. And don't forget guys, the Defender body kit is available. We have the uh, Black Edition version and we have the 007 Edition. So uh, we have also, we also have the off-road pack, the Expedition pack available for Defenders. But anyway, we're not talking about Defenders now, we're talking about the G-Wagons. And uh, this is Mr. Gonda's G-Wagon, or Adrian's G-Wagon should I say. Rizwan's is currently at the tyre shop getting the wheels fitted and it'll be back very shortly. We're putting the 23 inch Casanova gloss black on his car as well. And uh, uh, identical body kit, exactly the same. They are business partners and they want the cars to be identical. The only thing that's gonna be different is of course the color of the vehicle. But I'm sure once we've done the vehicle, probably at summertime, they probably will get the cars wrapped the same color. So stay tuned for that one. So yeah, I'm thinking of leaving the body kit black and uh, I think it will definitely, I think it'll be right. Will it be right? Should I flip a coin? How do I make a decision? Well, sometimes you just gotta go with your gut instinct. That's my job.
are almost complete. As you can see, we just pulled in the front end up now. And uh, we've got ourselves and all the star guns and the all done. Uh, we've got a small cow, the top roof lights. Dean is currently wrapping the side moulding. So everything that's chrome on this car is being de -chromed, which means everything's going black. So you can see Dean. Dean, you're whinging earlier on. What's up? These are just impossibly understandable. Are they horrible? Yeah. Everything that you do is horrible. Yeah, yeah. What is that you like doing? Apart from going on holidays. <laughs> I'm not feeling well, but I feel horrible, but I'm at work. Yeah, doing what? Talking? Hey? Doing do you know how that is? This is harder. It's harder to talk than actually do the job. Well, you do this, I'll talk. Hey, go you on then. You do this, rap rubbers. Go on then. I bet you get pissed off straight away with it. Go on then. Go on then. Go on then, get on there. <laughs> Come on, let's see how you talk. Go on <laughs> then. No, 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 no. Exactly. Go on, let's see how good you are talking. I don't talk, hey? man. Anyway, the G-Wagons are almost complete. Anyway, this is Adrian's car. Hell of a lot of work has gone into these, but these are two monster G-Wagons. So what we've done, we've also painted the meshes gloss black. As you know, in the G63 model, they come in like a matte black, like a plastic finish. Uh, they didn't look right once we put the body kit on, it just looked a bit tacky and a bit, bit too plasticky. So I didn't want anything plastic on the car, so I painted it all gloss black with a grill as well. And we went for the gloss black body kit, so we were in two minds, should we paint it, colour code it to the car, or paint it gloss black? So I've gone for the gloss black. Hopefully they like it and they trust me. And uh, when they pick the car up, they're not disappointed. We're going to smoke out the top roof lights, got the carbon bonnet, etc. Anyway, these are going to be wrapped in the side steps on these as well well hopefully Umar will be helping on this one we're painting the exhaust black as well so there'll be nothing chrome on this car so it'll be the colour of the car and gloss black so let the guys finish off the cars get them detailed and we'll do the review <laughs> You need? You got a blade? Give me this. Okay, it's Hawkeyes. Can you see? You can't probably see this. I can't even see my eyesight so bad. Better not scratch the bonnet. You see that in there? I've got it. Come on. That's that little bit, but it's all the way along. There you go, it's coming out. It's like bursting the spot. There we go. Perfection. So Adrian and Riz are here to collect their G-Wagon. What a conversion this has been. So I've done two G-Wagons and my job was to make them look identical. Obviously the colours are different, but I'm supposed to put the same kit on and the same wheels and do the exact same modifications on both of them. Why? Because they're both business partners. They like to share things, not everything, but a lot of things, and they like to have their cars looking exactly the same. Now the question is, have I done a good enough job on their G-Wagons? Well, let's see, they've drove all the way up from London and it's, as you can see, it's just past 10 p.m. and we're gonna do the collection now. We work 24 hours around the clock for our customers, whatever time is convenient for them, we will be here and we'll deliver on time, every time. Well, anyway, they're here now. I'm excited about this reveal. Let's do it. Hey. Oh, oh you're so colourful, my brother. <laughs> Hello. Hey, no, it's just louder than mine. Are you going on a date or a night out or you come and collect your car? I'm always loud, man. I'm always loud, you know me. Your I'm car is just... even louder. I've never had a sure? customer uh, make so much oh, effort uh, to come collect their car. <laughs> wow, you look like a basketball <laughs> player. Long Finally. Day, I'm not going to lie, I've got butterflies. <laughs> to be honest with you, I've got, I've got a little bit of anxiety myself. Because mm. this is the first time I've done a double conversion. Okay. Anyway, how's the Defender that you stole off me? <laughs> She's oh, you bought it today? We put yeah. Oh, Mars. Yes, we changed the number plate. Oh, wait, look, we need to go outside and have a look at this. So London, actually people, I'm not going to lie to you. In What's London, the response? They actually, I was sitting there and then the guy passed. He was walking his dog and it's come and he goes like that. And then he looked at me and then he's going around the car. So I've referred you two or three people already. I think one of them has called you already. Um, one they have. We had a uh, lot of phone calls yeah, about this car, actually. Yeah, it's, yeah. This car is... Everyone wants this. Everyone Can they pronounce wants... the name properly? That's the question. Ex ex 
properly. With Proper way. Yeah. Yeah. Let's see if you can pronounce it. Barakzai. Oh, yes, <laughs> my <laughs> brother. That's what <laughs> time it is. I like so it. This, you know, you know your, your work is, it's 200 miles traveling. I don't travel even 10 miles. No, I appreciate so, that. You've you come know, a long way. But the effort you put in the car is... Quality, yeah, well, it's not about this car because obviously when you came to drop your cars off, yes. you wanted a taxi back home, and it cost you a lot of money. That taxi did. Yeah, we. He's the new black cab, guys. Yeah. He's the new we London black cab. But while we're still here, <laughs> we're gonna leave this with you because you want the interior. More customization. I like to, it. To look exactly like your one. Oh, okay. Yeah. So you do all the interior. Yeah, we well, need to do Falcon all the interior. interior yeah. I like it. Well, I, I did say that it's to you, didn't I? It's a bit dirty, like I said, we use our cars every day, so you want... But, uh, be honest, when you took this car, yeah. he sent me some videos. And how many days did you spend cleaning this car? You didn't even come to work, did you? Yeah. Two days? How many did you spend in Halfords? <laughs> <laughs> and all that cleaning gear? <laughs> Better you sold me out. The company. <laughs> you sold <laughs> me <laughs> out. <laughs> you sold me out. How about the conversions? Let's go back to, to the working. What about your G-Wagons? <laughs> we will you go forgot. to the G-Wagons, so, but okay. let's do this first. I so you're leaving change, this car with you're me? leaving it with you. We need to change this to do exactly the same thing you did. Oh my god, you've got to stick the whole dashboard down. That's a massive yeah. job. Yeah, but job. you can do it. You've we done can't it do it. We can't We've do it. it That's yeah. the main job and then obviously the rest you, you, you know what to do. Okay, so we have an interior Wait, customization stage two. See, yeah. yeah. You got let's see the yeah? G-Wagon, come yeah, on. The Starlights as well. Starlights as well? Yeah, on this one. Right, let's go back inside. It's a little okay, bit cold today. Yes. We're looking forward to the Defender conversion, but listen, it's all about the G-Wagons. The two G-Wagons. Yeah. Wow. Did you put my rims on? Well, I don't know, you'd have to wait and see, won't you? That's the whole point. Because I chose this one. I'm pretty sure I chose this one, but in black. Well, I yes, remember choosing this one. So this comes in 22-inch and 23-inch. So you left, it to you. You left so everything to me, everything didn't you? Everything yeah. to you. I appreciate that. To you, yeah. I am the car tailor, of course. But I obviously appreciate that you put all that trust into me. One of the, you know, obviously very expensive cars as well. Big trust. Oh, I appreciate that because I've come in at just after 10 o'clock to do the handover. Yes. Mm. But anyway. That's and we're it. lucky as well because you do resprays. I'm hoping you resprayed my bumper because mm -hmm. that matte color wasn't going to match. Let's wait and see what's we did quite a lot to the cars actually, a lot of detailing as well. So it's all about the detail. Yes. But I think everybody's waiting to see these cars. Yes, oh, yeah. let's, let's. I think the more anxious than you guys are. Let's go do it. Are you ready? Yes. yes let's okay, go. let's do the video. <laughs> Try close your eyes because you're going to walk this way. The reason I'm doing this because I want to see the oh face view of the car. Can I go this way? Seriously, I can hear. Yeah. I mean, he's not peeking. Look down that way. You know, it's like a bitch. Okay, my heart's beating like mad, honestly. Just like the engines on the G Wagon. I can hear my engine. This is good, this actually. Yeah. Like, I can make you wait. How long should I make you wait for? Mm. <laughs> how's the goosebumps now? How's the, how's the butterflies oh in the stomach? God. Are they rattling? <laughs> anyway, guys. So, two standard G63 G Wagons. And they do look amazing. Standard, don't get me wrong. Yes. But these look monstrous now. And hopefully, I've been you guys proud and you have to do this. Are you ready yeah. to turn around? Yes. Right, guys. Your G-Wagon customized. Woo! I'm not joking. What do you think, Chris? Man. What do you think? I'm going to. Is it right. worth that wait? Is it worth that travel? Is it yes. worth that journey? My God. Blacked out the whole step as well. Come on. Come on. Come on. Huh? Look at the back. Look at the back. Which one do you prefer? The grey one or the blue one? You know what? And the bee would try to figure out which one he actually liked. Really Look up. Look up. Look up. Look up. I do I even put your 
Jesus tape us back in as well. <laughs> oh yeah, what's my slippers? The guys that wear Rolexes and drive G-Wagon, they're the kind of slippers they wear. It's like a humble, that's showing how humble he is really. We've got the Barag Zai body kit on there. We've got the front lip and the rear bumper lip as well. Now, when we put them on, we painted them gloss black. We were going to paint them the same colour as the car. Right. Mm -hmm. But we just, well, I decided to paint them gloss black. So I wanted them to stand out, better. look yeah. a little bit more monstrous and aggressive. Mm -hmm. yes. And then uh, when I did that, a bumper grills were like a plastic, yeah, matte plastic. Yeah, yeah, and it yes. just didn't look right. So we removed all the bumpers and we painted the grills. And also, we painted the essential grill as well, including all your emblems. So we glossed out all the trims. We've got the carbon fibre bonnet. We were yes. going to go for the uh, painted one but we went for the carbon fibre oh, instead. That's amazing. And amazing. Uh, we swapped out your headlights, your indicators, etc. And uh, we've got the top roof spoiler. Yes. Painted that gloss black as well. Yeah. Your side steps were chrome. Yes. We blacked all them out and also blacked out Black your down. quad exhaust. Mm -hmm. wow. We've got the 23 inch rims on there with 25 mil wheel spaces. We've got the floating center cap. Whoa. Yeah, so really? like the Rolls Royce. So like the Rolls Royce, so when the wheels spin, the Barak Zai logo stays Wheelspin. there, just floating. Coming around the back of the car, we've got the top roof spoiler. Right. And yeah, we detailed the whole car, polished it all up and finished off with the Star Galaxy roof firing at the end. Amazing. And uh, we've done the exact same to your car. Well. Mm. There's no point in going around your car. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. They're identical, apart from yeah. the colour. Now the question is, which one looks better? <laughs> it's obvious. I don't want you to, to argue about that now. <laughs> because <laughs> one day, because that's cause that question's gonna pop, isn't it? Because mm. first thing when my friend Nadim seen the car, he was like, "Ooh, they're just staring at him." I think, "What's he doing?" Has he seen like some imperfections? Because he's got Hawkeyes, and trust me, he can see imperfections from far away. Do you know? I, I like his better than mine. You <laughs> like his, and he likes yours. <laughs> no. no, no. <laughs> we'll decide which is better. Let's go to the front anyway, and uh, let's decide which is better. Let's, let me hug first. They are in love with their cars. I think I've done a good job, right? <laughs> anyway, let's get marks out of 10. Can you get through there? Yeah, we'll try. <laughs> He's just dented his wing. <laughs> now it's the fingerprints. <laughs> now, what's your response? Come on. I think you've been, my, you've been my best friend for almost 40 years. Oh, yeah. Do you understand? He's seen oh, yeah. me develop from a back garden. And to be honest with you, when yeah. I started this industry when I was 16 years old, I said to him, mm. You go to college and do motor mechanics and I'll do body work. Do you remember okay. that conversation? I remember yes, it I so clearly. And I said, we'll out. set up our own business. But he said, no, I'm going to go do business studies. He's got a good job, but still, you know, it'd be nice if you were my business partner as well, just like you two. And maybe we could have two G-Wagons as well. <laughs> it's, it's similar to me and Rhys. That's exactly how I saw it. I told him, Rhys, leave everything you're doing. Come and just work on the money and I'll do the rest. And you're buying G-Wagons now. So tell us a little bit about your business as well and maybe some, uh, obviously, your hard work, how you developed. Maybe give some inspiration to youngsters that are watching. Like, a lot of kids dream of having cars like this. Yes. And, you know, dreams do come true. Yeah. I mean, we are just like, we were just like these kids that are watching. Yes. And, you know, anybody, anything is possible. Of anyone course, could be a superstar, anyone could be a, a businessman, anyone could make money. But what's, you know, what, what, is, what, what do they need to achieve hard that? Hard working. Hard working. You have yeah. to work hard. And, you know, it's, it's... Whatever you do, you have to love your job. So, you know, you, you don't want to be in a job where you're not just for money. So you need to work and, you know, you need to, what I say, hard work, basically. Yeah. Everyone, you know, whoever you listen to. It's Understand a, your customer. Make sure your customer gets what they need. That's what we do. We specialize in making sure that our customers get exactly what they need when they need it. And we do not compromise on that. If our customer tells us 30 minutes, We'll be there in 30 minutes. If they say 20 minutes, we'll tell them maybe 20 minutes might be tough, but maybe 30 minutes. Then they'll understand. So honest communication with your customer. Yes. That's the top thing. And making sure that you treat everyone with the same respect that you treat those with money and those without. Yes. It'll work out. You and giving back. And giving back. Get That's something that he taught me. Every single couple of months, he's always giving back to, to charities. Oh, yeah, but make sure you, yeah. it's, you know, mm -hmm. in, especially in Islam, you know, we say if yeah. they give you your left hand, your right hand shouldn't know. Yeah. So, you know, we, all, everyone does it. So, mm -hmm. you know, we'll make sure to help them. Yeah. And, you know, maybe the, because of their prayers, where we are. Because when we started, we were, came from, actually, you know, when people tell you, you came from, from down. Yeah. That's what we did. 
Mm. And now we are one of the UK's maybe top five companies. Wow, that's great. Yeah, so, mm. you know, well, that's a great achievement. You've worked yes. hard and that's some great advice, guys. So make sure you take it. And uh, anyway, the cars. Every, every mile it was worth coming because it was a long yeah. drive, especially Friday. And, you know, thank you for you to staying up for, you know, no, for no, me, any time. So, you know, coming and it was a, you know, motorway. But yeah. now I feel like, you feel I like swear to God, I feel like I didn't, even, have flown out the I didn't stomach. even travel. No, I appreciate so it's, that. It's not about just car customization. It's about meeting great people like yourself. Mm. This is why I'm really passionate about my work because mm. uh, through this journey, I get to meet great people. And obviously, yes. hopefully for me, we can network and do uh, definitely, you know, definitely. greater things. Bigger things yeah. And uh, most importantly, putting a smile on your face yes. oh, yeah. and uh, you know, making you happy. And obviously, oh, you yeah. can drive these cars around in London, but what do you think is going to happen to London when these cars oh, arrive yeah. in London? Shut down. You know, seriously, shut down. You know the funny thing? I stay right next door to the Arsenal training ground. So hopefully we'll get some Arsenal footballers coming here, yeah? Yes. With their G-Wagon. Yes. yes. Thank you very much for trusting me with your cars. I appreciate that. Man, man. Now you can take your Rolex off and give me it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm, joking, I'm joking, I'm joking. I don't even feel hungry now. I was so hungry before. Mm. <laughs> I'm, I'm lined up for a nice meal for you guys. I'm like, oh yeah, that's going to be nice. Yeah, we're going to have a nice meal. I can't wait to take this in the morning tomorrow, the drive up to... Newcastle. Newcastle. We're going to go to Newcastle then. So these guys are yeah. joining me at a one year anniversary in yeah. Newcastle. And uh, they're going to join us in these two G-Wagons and we're taking the Defenders up as well. And we're going to have a crazy day there as well. I feel a lot more relaxed as well because I've had a lot of tension on these cars, honestly. You know, we do customise roughly about 10 to 20 cars a week. And the amount of tension that I have on all the cars, but these two. Because they're like double. Double the tension because I have to satisfy you both yeah. and make sure you're both I'm happy with the cars. And I have to kind of make it equal because I couldn't make one look better than the other. And uh, I have to make the right decision because if I did paint them in the same colour as the car and it didn't look right, that was my responsibility. Yes. I had to correct it. But anyway, I'm glad I've done a good you job. You spot on about everything. everything. You know what yeah. you said, this thing will look oh, yeah. and now oh, yeah. I couldn't see before I'm thinking. But I I'm so glad I left it to you. Yeah, Thank you very much. Yeah. Anyway, marks out of 10. Ooh, 12. Too small. 10 is too small. Yeah, 10, 10 is, is too, too small. small. I agree. 10 is too How small. do you say this car is amazing in your language? Motayaka Pengai. There you go. Motayaka Pengai. And it's all by your language? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I have to think. <laughs> Come on. Zabardast. There you go. Zabardast. That's the key word. But anyway, I'm glad you guys love your cars. And I uh, hope you guys like the conversion and the finished result. If you do want to comment which colour you prefer, they both are exactly the same. I love yeah. them both. I cannot choose between them. But if you do want to comment, you like the grey one or the blue one. Anyway, we'll see you next time. Thank you for watching. Stay tuned and we'll see you on the next vlog. Bye.